Yes. Now discuss about the venous drainage of the heart. First of all, you, you can see here, this is anterior surface of the heart. There is posterior surface of the heart. In this diagram, you can see this is right atrium, right ventricle, there is left auricle, this is left ventricle. Here is right atrioventricular groove, right atrioventricular, this is right atrioventricular groove. And posteriorly, posterior atrioventricular groove. Here is anterior interventricular groove. This is anterior interventricular groove. And here is left atrioventricular groove. This is left atrioventricular groove. And it continues as posteriorly, as posterior left atrioventricular groove. Here, on this surface, you can see there are three to four veins present over the right atrium. These veins are anterior cardiac vein. These veins are anterior cardiac vein. These three or four veins are present here. And here is another vein. This is marginal vein. This is marginal vein. This is marginal vein. If you cut the right anterior wall of the right ventricle like this and reflect like this. Here you can see numerous musculi pectinati. These are numerous musculi pectinati. And here is crista terminis. This is crista terminis. This is crista terminis. Crista terminis musculi pectinati. And now these veins, opening of these veins are present here. Here. So these are opening of the anterior cardiac vein. This chamber is right atrium. Here is marginal vein. So here is opening of the marginal vein. This is opening of the marginal vein. And here in this chamber you can see here. This is opening of coronary sinus. This is opening of the coronary sinus. And here you will find septal wall. This is opening of the coronary sinus. So in right atrium, these veins open, anterior cardiac vein, marginal vein, and coronary sinus. This coronary sinus present on diaphragmic surface. This is about 3 cm long. This is coronary sinus. Here, in this diagram, here is position of the coronary sinus. This is diaphragmic surface. And here is position of coronary sinus. And it opens, this is, this part is right atrium. Here is opening of this. This is coronary sinus. This coronary sinus, which length is about 3 cm, it receives 5 tributaries. One tributary lies here. This is isma cardiac vein. This is small cardiac vein. This is small cardiac vein. Small cardiac vein. Here lies small cardiac vein. 
This is small calibre. And there is middle cardiac vein. This is middle cardiac vein, which lies in posterior interventricular room. This is present in posterior interventricular room. This is this is small cardiac vein. This is middle cardiac vein. In this diagram, you can see here is middle cardiac vein. This is middle cardiac vein. And the vein is present on dapping surface. This is posterior vein of this is posterior vein of left ventricle. Here is posterior vein of left ventricle. This is posterior vein of left ventricle. And the vein here is oblique vein of left atrium. This is oblique vein of left atrium or oblique vein of muscles. This is oblique vein of left atrium. Here you can see oblique vein of left atrium. And the vein that is great cardiac vein. Great cardiac vein here it lies in anterior interventricular roof. This is great cardiac vein. And it turns into left atrioventricular roof. Then it runs into left posterior atrioventricular roof and opens into this. Here in this diagram you can see here this is position of great cardiac vein. It turns like this and this is anterior interventricular vein. So this is great cardiac vein which opens into the coronary sinus. So in coronary sinus five veins open. The small cardiac vein, middle cardiac vein, Posterior vein of left ventricle. Here is great cardiac vein. This is great cardiac vein and oblique vein of left atrium. So these are numerous veins which opens into the coronary sinus. In addition to this, sometimes this marginal vein, this marginal vein directly opens into here, coronary sinus, or sometimes it initially opens into a small cardiac vein, through small cardiac vein, it opens into the coronary sinus. And the vein present in every chamber, these are small veins known as vena cardis minimi. These are numerous small veins, these are vena cardis minimi or Thevesian vein. So this is all about the venous drainage of the heart.